additive manufacturing manufacturing control and automation so we will be discussing about this topic so we'll start with the cnc nc and dnc machine tools so what is a nc machine tool a machine tool is a device using which we can remove material or we can perform some kind of operations so what is this nc nc is numerical control so any machine tool if we want to remove material the tool has to move in relation to the workpiece so if the tool has to move there has to be some kind of motors or other drive systems using which we can create this motion so whenever we say motion it has to be a relative motion between tool and workpiece so conventionally this motion is either generated by using motors to get the movement of the tool and using a manual control by using hand wheels or by using some lead screw and nut mechanism we can generate the motion but movements given by manual methods are not accurate so the accuracy of the parts are going to be affected so in order to improve on the accuracy automation is built into the machine tools and improving on it we are having something called as numerical control so in numerical control the required motion is generated by using a program and this program is read by the machine and the required relative motion is achieved so the program is fed to the machine using a system called as punched cards and there will be a corresponding punched card reader which will read the program and then it gives signals to the drive systems creating the required kind of motion so whenever we say nc machine tool it will have a regular machine tool in which the drive systems or the movements are controlled by using a program fed through a punched tip so what is the disadvantage of this the disadvantage is once the punched tape is produced the program is fixed if any change in program is needed the tape has to be reproduced or we have to manually or physically cut the tape and join some other part to get a new program and because it is a physical material over repeated usage that tape will be damaged and thus you require additional efforts to safeguard and safe keep the tape the punched tape will contain the program which will be read by the tape reader and the machine tool will be able to perform all the operations that are programmed into it so this is a basic nc machine tool so advancement into the computation technology and electronics has led to cnc machine tool here we are having a computer that is built into the machine that is why it is called as computer numerical control so whenever we say computer it will be having a display it will be having input devices and the program here is not fed through a punched tape but through a software kind of program so we can have memory cards memory chips and other things using which we can load the program into the machine so because of the software kind of program input and the presence of the computer in the machine a lot of complex computations can be performed and we can get much larger variety of components using a cnc machine tool also it is possible to edit the program in the machine itself 
because all you have to do is you have to edit the program which is visible in the display terminal by using the various keys it is possible to change the program this is one of the major advantages of having the cnc machines over the nc machines so the computer gives additional capabilities to the machine in the computation and also in the visualization of the process and also to edit the program to create new program in the machine itself all these things are possible in case of the cnc machine tools the next one is a dnc machine tool the dnc can be described in two ways one is direct numerical control other one is distributed numerical control so if it is a extension of the cnc system wherein the program to the individual machines can be supplied through a single high capacity computing system so if you are having one central computer and if you are supplying the program to various machine tools then it is called as direct numerical control and in this system each of the machines will not have the separate computing capacity they will only depend on the central computer for the set of instructions so once the instruction set is received the machine tool will perform those instructions and it will wait till the next set of instructions are received now further improving on this capability we are having something called as distributed numeric control wherein we will be having a central computer which is having lot of capabilities and apart from it we will be having a computer at each of the machines so this computer can store the programs and it can execute them as per the requirement and it can give information to the central computer for newer programs or it can send back some additional information which is required for other areas of the manufacturing so that will be the distributed numerical control so from nc advancement has happened to cnc from cnc we are having direct numerical control and we are having distributed numerical control so whenever you are having a computer at the machine the advantage is it is possible to store the programs at the machine any changes if required can be done so what should the program contain it should contain information regarding the movement of the tool the parameters for speed feed depth of cut the tool selection the detection of the work piece inside the machine signal to the operator for any emergency or any malfunction in the machine so all these capabilities will be built into the nt machine tool so that the task can be completed in a more effective manner and also at higher accuracy higher accuracy is because the movement of the tool is controlled not by human operator but by a program 